Hey guys, in this video I want to pose the question, is building an OnlyFans agency actually worth it? I think all of us know that it actually absolutely is, if you know what you're doing. Now in this video, I'm going to show a few pieces of the puzzle that if you know this information, you will make an exceptional amount of money in this industry. But if you don't know these few puzzle pieces that I'm about to show you in this video, you will struggle and remain at the same level as all the other agencies out there. One thing I will say though, is you want to outperform the competition. You want to be the top dog in the industry if you're not trying to be the best then you're the worst that's just my mindset and if you can't adopt this mindset if you look at the competition you get scared or you feel like oh I'm not gonna be the best there's no way there's always someone better out there you're going to struggle now the things I'm gonna show you in this video are going to allow you to actually be the top dog to actually have those results that others can't compare to but before we get into this video guys I need you to smash the subscribe button button if you're trying to get into this industry we share at least three to five videos per week about exactly how to build a six to seven figure only fans agency so smash the subscribe button and we'll dive right in now before we get too deep into it as an OnlyFans agency, what kind of services do you provide these creators? You can handle the chatting, you can handle the overall account, you can handle the mass PPV posting, you can handle the main page posting, or you can handle all of them together. All right, so one of the things you need to know about this business, guys, is it's going to be a lot easier if you have a registered business behind this, okay? So you want to get an LLC. All right, you want to have a registered business because if you're taking payments with Stripe, Square, or any of these kind of things where you're paying out your models or you're doing invoicing, you are at some point going to get a hold on your account and that's going to be an issue or PayPal. So you want to have a registered business behind this. And you want to say that the business, like when you're signing up for Stripe, Square, PayPal, you want to say that it's just either consulting or you're doing marketing services for your clients. This is just something that you want to have. Now, another thing that we do is we create a private trust that is it's set up like an ecclesiastical irrevocable private trust. And that's where we pay out from our LLC to our private trust so that we don't have that much of a tax liability. And that's something else that we talk about in our course. I'm not going to go over it on this video right here. And this is not tax advice at all. Okay. But you want to make sure that you do have a registered business. And that is very, very important before you start. Now, the other thing that's very important is you want to have an Instagram page that looks legit. Now, you guys can go over to Black Cherry Agency LA and look at our Instagram that we have set up. All right, you want to show results on there and you want to talk about the different things that you offer, the different services that you offer, and you want to go into a little bit of detail so that when a creator is looking at your Instagram, she's like, oh, they know what they're talking about and they have results, okay? The other thing is you want to have some sort of a website, all right, some sort of a home page where they can go and they can look at your background because they're going to do their due diligence and they're just going to make a decision really quick. Are they legit or are they not legit? If you're just showing screenshots, that's not enough. But if you have a good looking Instagram account and you have a home page, there you go. Now you're talking. OK, another thing that we do for authority is we have a course. We have landing pages for that course. We have a YouTube channel and we feature all these things on our Instagram page. They're all in highlights. Right. And so when these girls actually are, you know, stalking us and doing their due diligence, they see, you know what? This agency is about it. They are authorities in this space and I want to investigate them more or I want to hop on that call with them and see what they're really about. All right. Now, when it comes to what you're going to be offering your creators, if you can do a full account management, obviously you can take more. You can take about 50 percent. As you see, I'm in our studio right here so we can do photo shoots for the girls. You know, we can do the messaging. I have a background in copywriting, so we can actually do the account posting, uh, the PPV strategies. We do literally everything for our girls so we can take 50%. Now, I know some people say that you should probably hire one of your friends or, you know, start building a team from scratch. I don't recommend this at all. What I recommend is you go to Fiverr or Online PH and you find people that already have experience and results in the industry. There's 
plenty of chatters out there that have already worked with agencies, right? And all you have to do is hire them and they're going to get you results day one. There's already account posters out there. There's already social media managers that can just post the content that these girls give you or edit and post the content that these girls give you. So you want to start building a team. In the beginning, you definitely want to learn it yourself and master it, especially if you don't have that much money to invest because you want to know if you're hiring these people, are they actually good? So yes, you want to learn as much as you can. Watch all the YouTube videos. Take all the courses, guys. Take all the courses. Unless you see some people saying that their course isn't good, obviously don't buy those person's course, but you should take all the courses. You should watch all the YouTube videos. You should join all the groups and learn. Literally have a doc on your computer where you're writing down all these things that you're learning, okay? Stay organized on your computer. Have folders, have files, and have different pieces of content. Even save YouTube videos into these folders or make playlists on your YouTube channel. You need to take accountability to become the best in your field and master your craft all right now if you don't have all the resources to take over full management of the account it's totally fine you could just master chatting for example and position yourself as the best chatting agency in the game and then take 25% for example from these girls and if you get one girl doing 10k a month maybe she's already doing 10k and you just come in and do the chatting that's already 2500 you get four of them there you go you add it up you're making 10 grand a month right then and there right that's only four you had to position yourself you had to learn chatting maybe took you a month to do that to make an instagram account and to learn chatting but the next month you can get four creators easily and actually drive her results because you obviously have to drive her results or you don't get paid right and then there you go you're making 10 grand a month so there's a lot of opportunity in this space even if you don't have all the resources to take over full management all right so how do you find these models where do you find them how do you actually go out there and recruit these models now over here at black cherry agency we have some unorthodox ways of actually recruiting models that nobody's talking about in the industry i'll give you one right now so we built up our instagram account and it looks really good we have all the results there and everything she needs to know basically on our page so i don't even have to pitch them then we have a mother slave DM blast service that we offer because we have a connection with some guy in the black hat world in the black hat space. And he has these bots that literally will go and take, let's just say I give him an agency, one of our competitors, right? I give him this guy. He scrapes them. He gets all their followers. He has all these slave accounts built up. Basically these child accounts that are just for a certain niche. Maybe it's a models account that has 10,000 followers on it beautiful beautiful photography beautiful content on there it looks legit when you look at the account you're like that's a real girl that's a real person he has hundreds of thousands of these accounts already built up and then the bot actually follows and likes and engages with our target audience the people that are following the agency that i gave him to scrape super simple now once they engage back with us because we have already followed and liked them that's when he shoots them a dm I mean, the bot is already set up to do this. It's very sophisticated. And so 50% of those DMs are going to land in the inbox. So this is what we did, guys. This is literally what we did. We just targeted an agency that's in our area over here in LA because we're out here in Orange County. And basically, we just targeted them with DM blasts and they followed us first before they even got a DM sent to their inbox. Another way we did it was we made a little video basically and we put it up on Facebook ads. So I was just driving in my car, cruising in a BMW. It helps that I have a BMW, right? It helps that we had a model in the back seat, one of our models. So there was already social proof there, right? There's already expert proof there, authority proof because of the BMW. Maybe you got an AP on, whatever. So I looked the part and I'm just talking about basically driving her results and getting her to the top 1% and reach out to us. And we had like 70 girls reach out to us and we spent literally like a hundred bucks. It was crazy. Like a hundred 
100 to 200 bucks when we saw like 70 girls reach out to us. So we turned off all the, the recruiting because that's too many girls for us to even handle. You just want to weed through all the girls and find the ones that are the most ambitious and start off with a good handful. Five to 10 girls. You don't want to do too many. It's too much work. You're going to overload yourself. Wait till you can scale your agency and build teams out before you start to do that. Now, you guys can see that we have a dope logo. We look good. We look professional. Everything looks good on our Instagram. Uh, it could be better, right? There's always room to improve. But because we can have girls actually hit us up, it's very easy to recruit. But another thing is when we get results for girls, we're getting referrals now because girls like to talk about it. Or if a girl doesn't want to do OnlyFans, she finds her friend for us to do OnlyFans. Like it's crazy. So finding these creators once you set up everything properly is very, 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 very easy, guys. So if you have your LLC set up, right? and you have your logo set up, you have your Instagram set up, you have a website set up, you have the results, you have the screenshots, you talk about it like you understand it, like you're an authority, you're gonna have no trouble, guys. And you could do it with your phone. You could do it with your 4K video camera on your phone. Yes, we have a lot of content um, that is very professionally made, but you don't need that, okay? Obviously, you guys see these YouTube videos are looking amazing, and we're recording on a, a black magic 6K camera right now, but you don't need that to make it work, okay? You can get our results or just as good with literally the bare minimum equipment. Now, one of the other things is signing contracts, getting the girl under a contract. We usually do a year contract. You want to make sure that the contract says that you have full ownership and rights to use her content, full ownership of her content and rights to use it in any way you desire. Okay. This is just so you don't have any problems in court later with these girls. Another thing is it's good to sign contracts if you're working with the girls in person because, you know, anything could happen. You're alone with these girls in a room. You're doing explicit content so they can make up stories. You don't want to do that. All right. All right. So the best way to get paid in this industry is to have full control over the girls only fans account and then have your bank account attached to it. We create multiple private trusts so we can open up multiple bank accounts and we attach it to it or we have the girl create a wise account and we just have access access to it, which is basically like an online bank account. We have access to it and we pay her out and we pay us out. And that's basically how we normally go about it. But if you land a whale of a client, she's not going to let you just come in and attach your bank account to her account because she's already doing 50K a month and you're just promising to add 30K to her bottom line. Well, in that case, you need to invoice her. And this is why it's important to have an LLC or a registered business set up so that you can create a Stripe account, you can create a Square account, you can create a Wave account and you know they're not gonna hold your money. Or even better yet, you can create a merchant account and literally go the legit way. That is the most legit way where you know you're not going to have issues because to be honest, I hate PayPal. I hate Stripe. I've gotten hundreds of thousands of dollars held in Stripe and PayPal in my life, guys. And yes, they finally pay it out after 90 days, but it's just a pain in the you know what. So you don't want to go that route usually. Okay. Yeah, guys. So the last thing we're going to talk about is what you actually need to do to get the results. Some of the things you're gonna need are a Twitter account, an Instagram account, a Reddit account, and not just one account. We like to create multiple accounts for our girls, along with TikTok accounts, Bumble accounts, Tinder accounts. We get her on the whole dating app circuit. We we like to get our models on, on every single dating app, no matter you know if we're gonna swipe on them or not, we're at least setting them up at least just putting them out there, putting their IG in the bio, calling it a day. The main dating apps that we do focus on, however, such as Bumble and Tinder, we hire swipers, we have a whole team, they'll handle swiping for the day for each girl. This brings in a ton of traffic. So another great platform we like to use is Reddit. This, we have a whole strategy, a whole breakdown in the course, but I'll just explain a basic overview. You know, we get the girl started with these aged accounts, certain amount of karma. From here, we put our virtual assistant on account management, and basically sh her job is to blow that Reddit account up, to blow up as many posts as possible. And obviously Instagram, 
with our mother's slave methods, with our DM services, with the DM blast, we could reach a hundred thousand people in a single day. We kind of have a similar strategy for Twitter. Um, we do a little bit of mother slave. We can hook them a little more with Twitter and Reddit because we're able to show a lot more on these platforms. We obviously touch further on these in the course, but this pretty much covers the basics. Twitter, Instagram, Reddit, dating apps. Very simple. We like to keep it simple and just scale as much as we can. And that pretty much sums it up, guys. Now, we go into depth and we leave no stone unturned in our course. If you are trying to actually reach that six-figure and seven-figure mark with your agency, then watch the rest of this video. All right, now, guys, so listen. If you are a beginner in this space, you know nothing about OnlyFans, you don't know how to start your agency, you have no idea what to do next... I highly recommend that you get the seven figure agency blueprint before going any further. So it's the top link in the description below. You just click on the link like this and you will go to a page that looks like this. Okay. You can scroll down. You can read more about it. Click on the button right here and it will take you to a pop up like this. Once you are at that pop up, you can click right here and you can go ahead and purchase and you will get access to create your account on the next page like this. If you've already gone through our course and you have all the information that you need to succeed right now, because remember, that's what matters because this game changes so much. If you're taking a course that's three months old and it's not getting updated in live real time, then you're going to struggle. So if you've already taken our course and you're already having some sort of results in the game right now, maybe five figures a month, and you want to guarantee to get to that six, seven figure mark, we have a 12 week coaching program where we walk you through the steps, hold your hand and make sure that we hold you accountable till you hit that mark. All right. Then what you're going to do is you're going to click the second link in the description. You're going to fill out your details that gives us more information on how we can help you. You're going to select a time and then you're just going to watch the video that's going to explain what the coaching program is about and what to expect on the call. And we will take it from there so with all that being said guys if you haven't already go ahead and smash that subscribe button we're going to be coming out with at least three videos a week that are jam-packed with value high quality content and we're not going to leave any stone unturned when we are explaining certain details about the business and on that note guys i will see you in the next video peace